feel like last week in this video, I looked really pretty and I was very spicy. Today, I'm in, like, I got spit up and throw up on me, but you know what? That's mom life. Mom life. One week, you're like on point, and the next week, you're on point with the purpose. <laughs> Hi, everybody. Welcome back to my channel. Today, I'm going to be doing our grocery haul and meal plan for this week. Also, I want to show you something that I got in the mail that I'm really excited to try. So, let's first start with our meal plan for this week. <laughs> Okay, so starting tonight, we were supposed to have ham bone soup, but unfortunately, our HEB didn't have any cubed ham, so I have to go run some errands later. If I feel like it and if I feel up to it because there's so many things that I have to go do, I might run into the other HEB and see if they have it, but if not, then we'll just substitute and move things around. Um, for lunches this week, I'm going to be making myself a healthier version of chicken salad that's got like, grapes and Greek yogurt in it. Uh, I think it also has like sliced almonds too. It looks really, really good. So I'm going to try that. And then for dinner tomorrow night, we're supposed to be having pancakes, sausage, muffins with eggs. So basically Brenner, where I'm going to make pancakes into little muffins and put little links of sausage. I'll show them to you in just a second. I think it's going to be amazing. Wednesday for dinner, we're having smoked sausage, broccoli, pasta. Avery's also got milk all over her face. She's drinking out of a straw and I guess she pulled back and it shot everywhere. Right? It's also like dripping some down her. Oh my bed. goodness. You're a mess. <laughs> anyway, um, Wednesday we're having, like I said, smoked sausage broccoli pasta. I make a sweet Italian sausage pasta. This one's more, I think, of like a spiced kind of pasta. And so I figured Robbie would really, really like it. And you can um, throw things in it like chickpea pasta. Or you can also throw lots of broccoli in it to get your greens in. So I think it'll be good. Thursday night we're having spice breeze. Which one are we having? Uh, Rogan Josh. Yeah. Rogan Josh. I'll show that one to y'all when I make it on Thursday or when they make it. I usually don't. Oh, I helped make this one last week. Yeah. Anyway. So, and then Friday we're having cheesy chicken broccoli pastry. We may actually have that for dinner tonight because of the ham bone soup because I think it's supposed to be super, super simple. So that one we can easily do and we can just throw um, a little side salad with it or something else to go with it that's going to be healthy. And then on Saturday, we're having a barbecue. We're supposed to be having a barbecue. And I haven't decided exactly what we're gonna do. Robbie, I'm sure, would love to do burgers. But I think Boy, yes. we might do like brisket or something. I need to think about that. Obviously, I have not actually planned for it and bought anything for it, so I'll have to do that. And then, of course, on Sunday, we have leftovers. We eat out for lunch on Sunday after church, and then we have leftovers for dinner. So let me show you the grocery haul. Good milk face. Avery also had a, a pretty good fall on yesterday, Sunday. Today's Monday. Today's Martin Luther King Day. So Robbie's off and we came home later from being at my parents' house. But she got a little scratch on her face. Actually, she got several. She fell off of a box when we were trying to take pictures. I'll insert the pictures right here because they're super cute. But at the expense of Abe's beautiful little face. From what it sounded like, it wasn't that she was like hurt. She was no, she mad. was just more upset. Her feelings were very much hurt. She was fine. I mean, she had like a little scrapes. She had little scrapes on her face and she had some grass in her mouth and dirt in her mouth, which I would be mad about that too. But she'd be completely fine. And then it was like she would remember that she had fallen and she'd <laughs> like get all dramatic. So I think more than anything, it just hurt her feelings. Okay, starting over here with our produce. We've got grapes in the back, bananas, green apple, which I think goes in my chicken salad. I can't remember specifically. Oh my goodness, she's going nuts over there. Anyway, I think it goes in my chicken salad. We have celery, which is supposed to go in the hand bone soup. We have carrots back there, which is supposed to go in the hand bone soup. And then broccoli, which will go in our pastry. And then also I think we'll have it as a side um, one or two nights. Raspberries, this is, we found, I think is Avery's favorite fruit is raspberries. So lots of raspberries. Greek yogurt to go in the chicken salad. Then let's go to proteins next. So I've got some turkey sausage for our smoked sausage broccoli pasta. And then these chicken sausages are gonna go in the pancake muffins. So I think that'll be really, really delicious. Um, we've got some better than bouillon, which is supposed to go in the ham bone soup. Some freshly grated Parmesan cheese, which will go with the broccoli puff pastries. Then we have Kodiak cakes. If you've never used Kodiak cakes before, they're a really good substitute for just regular pancake or flapjack mix. 
packed with protein, as it says protein packed at the top, packed with protein, super good, um, just a lot less calories and carbs. And then of course it's got tons of protein. And then I've got some elbow noodles, which I completely forgot. I should have just bought the bonzo ones. I forgot to get our chickpea ones, but that's okay. I've got some carb balance tortillas for like making quesadillas and things. I've been using one tortilla, cutting it in half and having half of a tortilla. And it's even better if it's gonna be carb balanced. So I'll use that. I've got some crescent rolls for those puff pastries. This was supposed to be something else, but I can't remember. But I think it was supposed to be puff pastries, but they were out of them. Some honey, because we ran out last week. Skinny cow, because this is just a really good dessert at nighttime. And then, have I gotten everything? Oh, baby stuff. So I got her a new cup, because the one we have doesn't have the little handles. And also, it's just really nice to have more than one, because she's always got, you know, like milk in one and water in the other, and sometimes, Sometimes you don't want to do the dishes right then and there. So we've got that one. And then I've got her, of course, some more Nutramagen and then her favorite Mighty Nut Butter Bar. She still really likes these. And then lastly, some semi-sweet chocolate chips for baking things. I've got some fat-free milk, which goes in some of our recipes. Apple cider vinegar goes in one of our recipes. I can't remember which one. And then I needed some makeup wipes. And let me tell you, I heard you loud and clear on last week's video that you really want me to do meal prep or what's for dinner so i will be doing a what's for dinner this week i promise i will get that done um tonight i don't know what we're having but i will try and video everything so that you have at least a couple different recipes to choose from if you are like completely brain fogged and don't know what to make for dinner so i'm gonna hope that that's gonna come out on sunday or monday so just be watching out for that let me show you what we got in the mail one of my favorite people to watch, or I follow her on Instagram, is Alicia Keithley, Neathley. She did Weight Watchers and she lost a whole bunch of weight. She had like weight loss, um, I mean, she had skin removal surgery. So I've been watching her a lot lately. And she is an ambassador for Alani New. Um, and they have like fit snacks, they have protein powders, they have um, protein drinks, they have energy drinks, they have pre-workouts. I'm not sponsored by them at all, but I just like to watch her because she's like life after weight loss. She does a lot of like, this is what I eat in a day and she's not on a program. You know, she just lives her life now. So I like to watch her cause she's a good inspiration for me. But one of the things that she does eat that looked delicious are these Alani new fit snacks, protein bars. So 12 of them come in here, I think. Yes, 12 bars. This is the Munchies flavor, which has cookie dough, salted caramel, and pretzels in it. And I figured Robbie could have some of these too if he wanted to. And then the other flavor that I got was the cookies and cream. She said this has been like her favorite one lately. So I wanted to try them just to kind of see something to have in the middle of the day whenever you are feeling really snacky, but it's not dinner time and you just had lunch. So check her out. She's really awesome. That's something that I aspire to be is somebody that people can watch when they're losing weight and also after they're losing weight so that they can kind of see like life goes on after weight loss. So I want to thank you guys so much for watching today. Thank you for all of your support on last week's video when I got a little spicy, a little saucy. Um, and I heard you loud and clear. I will be doing the what's for dinner. So until the next video, I love you all and God bless you.